back Seraphine the vlogs my name is Seraphine so on today's vlog I'm going to Nanyuki I'm starting my vlog inside the house um, I wanted to start it on my way out but it's drizzling here so I'm starting it in here to tell you of my plans for the weekend I'm going to Nanyuki we are going to Nanyuki um, with no plan at all um, I don't know what's good in Nanyuki not been in Nanyuki before but I went to visit my auntie so it was more of a, an in-house setting like not a tourist so today i'm going as a tourist um so i don't i don't really know the nice places there i don't know where you can actually visit you know when you're out there so it's just sort of like an adventure because i don't know where i'm going or what we're going to be doing time is also so much gone um it's 10 it's past 10 i was supposed to be out of here by latest eight um because it's gonna also take me a while to get there I'm using public transport which is <laughs> which is so weird to use when you're like going for an adventure but you should not let not having a car stop you from you know seeing places so I'm going to have shoes probably two or three matatus and that the problem I'm having with that is that they might take up some time to fill up and that would also you know consume a lot of time I'm hoping they're gonna fill up quickly um, so so that I get there on time and see what I can do you know um, so basically it's just like a small trip just to you know see what's good in Nanyuki to just see what's up in Nanyuki um, and really if there's nowhere to go I mean because of time and also because of non planning um, I mean we're just gonna go to a hotel and take some tea and it's gonna be something out of the ordinary you know it's gonna be different from just being in the house so yeah i want you to come with me um i'm gonna show you the activities that i'm gonna be doing you know if any because honestly i'm not sure i'm going to find any activities to do there so if i do i'm definitely come i want you to come along with me i want to show you that and um yeah i'll catch you up on the road I doubt that <laughs> it's not very easy vlogging in public areas so I'm just gonna catch up with you when I'm in Nanyuki probably after probably after a number of hours which I'm hoping won't be too long so yeah see you there <music> this you know you're actually on your way to Nanyuki so guys this is Narumoru town I thought you guys should have you know an, an idea of how towns here look like so yep guys this is Narumoru town We are finally in a new key town guys so i'm gonna be showing you a longer video of the town so that you may get a little familiar with it so yeah guys this is the final destination for the day so yeah enjoy this <laughs> finally took a border border to my airbnb so enjoy the view of nanyuki town
so i'm gonna be giving you a house tour of the airbnb that we got um so as you can see this is an overview of the whole living area and how it looks like i actually fell in love with the curtains I've, i don't like these colors but somehow um they were really going well with the whole theme of the house I love these decorative pieces put here there was a chess board there was monopoly and since i had just come from watching the queen's Gam gambit i actually had to play chess <laughs> so yeah there is monopoly there is um you know fresh flowers i loved loved that idea i really loved how how simple the house looked like but it was so so nice you know a simple dining area very simple nice looking table the carpet was also very nice the um the paint the you know the artwork was also very nice i love the coach it was really super comfortable the throw pillows were also going really well with the couch and with the colors of the house so yeah this is what i'm calling artwork i don't know what to call it but i just loved how it went to the house there is a plant there an actual live plant i really love that i love this this rug like everything was just so neat and so simple and so minimal but it was super super amazing so there is the washroom it's really bright let's go to the kitchen there's a small place there where you can put anything you want so let's go to the kitchen i really just ah uh, i just loved how simple and minimal everything was so there was a microwave the only thing there wasn't was a free there was no fridge um but everything else was really nice the utensils to use there's a burner there some cleaning supplies there that obviously i did not use i think just storage for some of your things some wine glasses some 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 tea glasses it was also lovely guys I love the piece that's holding the water that, that is so nice and so simple so as you can see there's a balcony there and that's how it looked outside and it looks so um, dry so let's go to the bedroom um, the curtain here was different it was gray but i loved it there's a rug there and a piece like the one in the kitchen it's so simple and so beautiful guys so i loved it and a very big bed like spacious bed there's a closet there some hangers there's an iron box the mirror there and me loving mirrors i had to I had to include myself in this video so yeah so there was also this uh, pamphlet can i call it that which was you know showing you um hotels around health cares around um tourist spots gym places around um this was really helpful cabs and well 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 some dancing took place mm, mm. <laughs> yeah some some good dancing took place this house is really really amazing next we went to a choma joint i know it doesn't look very appetizing but where so finally we went to moran lounge bar um is it moran lounge bar and grill 
you know, had some fun there to wind up the night. And yeah, it's a good place actually. <laughs> So this is how the apartment looked from the outside. Um, Nanuki just looks like a very, very dry place. As you know, it's on the leeward side. So hey, um, it's a very, it's not very chilly, but it's so somewhat chilly. Um, I was out to get some breakfast for, for breakfast. <laughs> I mean, like we've come here and so yeah, and I'm going to make some breakfast. Yeah. And then probably get prepared to check out. Because the checkout time is 10. But they've agreed to give us up to around 1. So I'm going to take a shower, take some breakfast. Then I'm going to check out. We are going to check out later. So it's me and the mirror again. So this is how I dress to prepare some food. I really love this burner. Um, you should stick around to see how, how red it burns at the end. So I placed my meat, um, just left it to just, you know, boil on its own with its own water. But I added some water. Then I made some breakfast, you know, as, as the meat, as the meat, um, <laughs> As the meat evas, so I, I really love the pieces. You know, the pieces were very beautiful, like the one that has the sugar. This other one that had um the different things. There was chocolate. There was um coffee. There was um another brand of coffee. Um, there was Milo. So I decided to use the Milo. I loved how beautiful their pieces were, honestly. So after a lot of boiling until the meat is tender, you know, it's time to add the ingredients. I only had um, onions and tomatoes and roiko, so that's all that I used. And obviously the tomatoes and the onions we had to buy ourselves. So that's what I was showing you. It burns really, really nicely. So I just added everything inside, plus oil, plus salt, plus the roiko, and just now leave it to boil. Looking yummy, yum yum. So this is the final um, look. Finally, I washed the utensils. I didn't want to leave them like that. I really don't know if someone is supposed to leave them or not, but it was just really nice to, you know, wash after us. So, yeah. So, hey, guys. Um, in Nanyuki, there is nothing really much to do, um, but there's this pamphlet that had these places, the tourist spots in, you know, in, in Nanyuki, like where you can come to if you're here. Um, so I'm going to read them to you so that if you want to come to Nanyuki, you know exactly where you can go. So the first one is the Equitamaka. I think this is a little bit famous, popular. 
Um, there is Mount Kenya for mountain climbers. So if you're a mountain climber, this is a place for you. Um, there's Old Pajeta Conservancy. Um, that is what that is also very popular. A lot of people know that, but I'm sure a lot of people have not gone there, myself included. There is Loisaba Conservancy. There is Smogie or it's Mogi Conservancy. There is Ngarendare Forest Park again for hikers and mountain climbers. Um, and finally, there's Mount Kenya Wildlife Conservancy. So those are the, the ones that are, you know, that are detailed here. Maybe there's more. But if you're coming to Nanyuki, at least now you have an idea of the things you can do. So mostly Nanyuki, it's it's mostly wildlife related. It's it's mostly wildlife related. So um, we've not done much of that because we came in late yesterday. So there was not, not much time for that. So we've just been here and there. So yeah, I think I'll sign off my video here. I don't think I'll be doing anything more than this because we're supposed to not be going back. Um, but it's been fun. Thank you for tagging along. I could show you some snippets after this, but I'll end the vlog here. So thank you for being with me on this journey. And until my next vlog, guys, bye-bye.